All right, we've made it here to Harvati, and I'm here with uh, Karen, a staff food writer at The Grid, and it's Burger Week. So, Karen, what can you tell us about Burger Week? Well, Burger Week is basically a festival of burgers in which we got about 25 restaurants all across the city to do a, basically a special burger just for us. A lot of them are doing a $5 burger, like here at uh, Havarti, and a big portion of it goes to the Stop Community Food Center, and it's just to encourage people to go out and explore the city, check out a bunch of different restaurants, have a burger, a pint of beer, and uh, just have fun. So what was the initial plan or strategy working with Stop? Why were uh, why was their initiative and their company uh, special for you, working with you guys? Yeah. Well, The Grid has been working with The Stop for a while now, about a year since it started. And The Stop is a fantastic organization here in the city. It's a food bank, it's a drop-in center, it offers after-school programs for children to teach them how to cook, how to grow food, where their food comes from. There's community ovens for people to come together and just make a pizza, because who doesn't want to make a pizza? And they have like fantastic gardens and greenhouse and they're all about food advocacy and teaching people to cook and to be a little bit smarter about their food. So this has been wild, wildly successful campaign during Burger Week. Some of the restaurants have been selling out of uh, their ground beef actually. April was just telling us uh, uh, a bit about the 100 pounds of ground beef that you've been selling in the last few, three days. The last three days about 150 pounds of ground beef and I got another hundred ordered for today and tomorrow. Okay. Yeah. And uh, so you weren't anticipating it. You're keeping up with the workload. Yeah, doing our what best. is it like? A lot of work. Okay. <laughs> We're definitely doing our best. We've got a way better response than we had originally anticipated. Uh, so we're just kind of working hard. We're long hours, kind of just making it work. You know, all you can really do is make it work. And tell us about the Harvati burger that uh, you guys are serving up. Well, we've got um, two thin patties of uh, um, hormone-free, free-range beef that we get from a local butcher down, down the street, try to keep it as local as possible. And then we have our beautiful steam creation bun, it's called lepinya, which is incredibly hot. Woo. And then in between the two patties, we have caramelized onions and smoked mozzarella cheese, which has made it a very popular burger. <laughs> People love it. So using hormone-free beef, why is that important? Well, I think it's important to keep things as natural as possible, you know what I mean? Like, there's too many additives and preservatives and stuff like that in food nowadays. We're trying to keep things as fresh and local as we can. We go, you know, we use the, the local market just down the corner. Every kind of everything we do is within a couple blocks of our restaurant at this point. So we're trying to stay as true to the neighborhood as we can, you know? So, Karen, just as April's talking about keeping a partnerships local, using local foods, um, how is that uh, unique and special for anything that the, the grid does? Yeah, well, the grid is all about community involvement and getting the locals involved as well, which is what a lot of the restaurants are doing as well, using local suppliers. And it, it's a fantastic uh, partnership that we've uh, kind of made together, yeah. And you also uh, partnered with uh, Muskoka, Muskoka Brewery. Why was, uh, why was that strategic and why did that work so well? They have good beer. <laughs> Straight up. <laughs> That's pretty much the they big do. reason. They do. It's one of my favorites for sure. Well, congratulations on the success of the campaign. Uh, tomorrow's Burger Day, and uh, April's actually going to be preparing for that as well, where all the chefs from the, is it 26 locations? Almost a couple dozen. It's in the ballpark. It's hard to keep up. There's so much going on this week. And uh, they're all coming together and trying out each other's burgers. So. Check out, uh, where, where else can we find out more about the, the Burger Week? Uh, just go to www.thegridto.com. It's all there. Okay. All right. Stay tuned. We're going to chow into uh, April's uh, creation here. It looks amazing. <laughs> Burgers. Contact your local television provider to subscribe to iChannel.